From the moment we grasp our first toy to the twilight years of our lives, grip strength is a constant companion. We depend on it for countless daily tasks. It's the force behind our handshake, a symbol of connection. We rely on it to lift groceries, open jars, and operate tools. A firm grip is essential for independence and quality of life. But grip strength is more than just a measure of hand power. It's a window into our overall health and vitality. Scientists and physicians are increasingly recognizing its importance as a predictor of longevity, disease risk, and cognitive function. It's a fascinating paradox. This seemingly simple act of closing our hand reveals a universe of information about our physical and even mental well-being. In this exploration we'll delve into the science behind this fundamental human attribute, uncovering the secrets to maximizing its potential. Grip strength isn't just about brute force, it's a complex interplay of muscles, tendons, and nerves working in perfect harmony. Imagine an orchestra, each section contributing to a symphony of strength. The forearm houses the primary muscles responsible for grip. The flexor muscles, located on the underside of the forearm, contract to close the hand. Their counterparts, the extensor muscles on the top, extend the fingers. These muscles are connected to the bones in our hand via tendons, strong cords of tissue that transmit force. But muscles and tendons alone cannot produce movement. They need instructions. This is where our nervous system takes center stage. Nerves transmit signals from the brain to the muscles, initiating and coordinating the intricate dance of contraction and relaxation that results in a powerful grip. The study of grip strength has captivated scientists for decades, leading to a wealth of fascinating discoveries. Researchers have found intriguing links between grip strength and a surprising array of health outcomes. One groundbreaking study published in the British Medical Journal found a strong correlation between weaker grip strength and an increased risk of premature death from all causes, including heart disease and cancer. Other studies have linked low grip strength to higher chances of developing type 2 diabetes, osteoporosis, and even cognitive decline. The reasons behind these connections are complex and multifaceted. Some researchers believe that grip strength serves as a reliable indicator of overall muscle mass and function, which naturally decline with age. Others point to the role of inflammation, a process implicated in numerous chronic diseases, which can also weaken muscles and impair grip strength. Knowing the importance of grip strength is one thing, but how do we go about enhancing it? The good news is that there are numerous simple yet effective methods to unlock your hand's hidden power. These techniques range from specialized equipment to everyday objects making it easy to incorporate grip training into your routine. One of the most popular and accessible tools is the hand gripper. These spring-loaded devices provide variable resistance, allowing you to gradually challenge your grip as you progress. Start with a comfortable resistance level and aim for 2-3 to three sets of 10-15 to 15 repetitions on each hand gradually increasing the resistance or repetitions as you get stronger. Another effective method is using a stress ball or grip ball. These malleable spheres provide a different type of resistance, engaging more muscles in the hand and forearm. Squeeze the ball as hard as you can for a few seconds, then release and repeat. You can also try squeezing and releasing the ball rapidly for a dynamic workout. Section 5. Beyond the Hand Grip Strength and Overall Health while we often associate grip strength solely with hand function, its implications extend far beyond our grasp. Emerging research reveals a fascinating interplay between grip strength and various aspects of our overall health and well-being. For instance, studies have shown a strong correlation between grip strength and cardiovascular health. Individuals with a firmer grip tend to have lower blood pressure, better cholesterol levels, and a reduced risk of heart disease. This link may be attributed to the fact that grip strength is a good indicator of overall muscle mass and fitness, which are known to benefit heart health. Moreover, grip strength plays a crucial role in maintaining bone density and preventing osteoporosis, a condition that weakens bones and makes them more susceptible to fractures. The act of gripping and squeezing stimulates bone growth and strengthens the bones in the hand, wrist, and forearm. Section 6. The Grip of Champions. Applications in Sports. In the realm of sports and athletics, grip strength reigns supreme as a fundamental pillar of performance. Across a vast spectrum of disciplines, 
from the explosive power of rock climbing to the precision handling of a tennis racket, a firm grip can mean the difference between victory and defeat. Consider the sport of rock climbing, where athletes rely on their grip strength to conquer vertical walls and navigate challenging holds. A climber's ability to maintain a secure grip is paramount, not only for upward progress but also for safety. Similarly, in baseball, a pitcher's grip on the ball influences the speed, spin, and accuracy of their pitches, while a batter's grip affects their swing and ability to make solid contact. The significance of grip strength extends to combat sports as well. In martial arts like Judo and Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, a strong grip is essential for controlling an opponent, executing throws and submissions, and maintaining balance and leverage during grappling exchanges. Section 7 Grip Training – A Lifelong Pursuit The journey to enhance grip strength is not a sprint but a marathon, a lifelong pursuit that evolves alongside our physical capabilities and aspirations. Whether you're an athlete seeking peak performance, a senior aiming to maintain independence, or simply an individual looking to improve your overall health, there's always room to refine and strengthen your grip. One of the key principles of effective grip training is progressive overload. This involves gradually increasing the demands placed on your grip muscles over time. As your grip strength improves, you can increase the resistance, repetitions, or duration of your training. This constant challenge signals to your body to adapt and grow stronger. Another crucial aspect is incorporating variety into your routine. Just like any other muscle group, your grip muscles can adapt to repetitive movements. By incorporating a diverse range of exercises and tools, you can target different muscles in the hand and forearm, preventing plateaus and maximizing overall grip strength. Section 8. Join the Grip Revolution. The exploration of grip strength has just begun. As we delve deeper into the intricate workings of our hands and their profound connection to our overall health, we unlock a universe of possibilities for enhancing our physical and mental well-being. Join us on this exciting journey of discovery as we continue to unravel the mysteries of grip strength. Together, we'll explore cutting-edge research, share practical tips, and inspire each other to unlock our full potential. Section 9. Keep exploring the cosmos of strength. Remember, the cosmos of strength extends far beyond our planet, far beyond our galaxy. It's a journey of constant exploration, a quest to understand the limits of human potential. Subscribe to our channel and embark on this adventure with us. Let's explore the universe of strength together, one grip at a time.